Hey, welcome back to Project 365. It's Julian Corey from SB Pace. It's December, and December we're really just having fun. This the theme this month is it's the most wonderful time of year, which it is. All right, Corey, share a memorable gift opening experience from your childhood. We can only see half your face, buddy. I know I'm thinking right now. Oh, okay. I don't I I don't have one. Really? Yeah. And like I, I can't think of like one I'm like, oh, that really like blew my mind or whatever. I mean. Yeah, like I don't know. Nothing really sticks out. So I have a couple of them that stick out for me. Um one of I'll say the one that sticks out the most is the one when I was like five-year-old Julie. And I don't know if this story, is, this question comes up later in the month. So this people might hear this twice, but I it was the it was the Christmas that Santa Claus got ruined for me, right? In that I had older siblings and my mom and dad weren't home. And they're like, hey, we want to show you something. And they took me to this back closet and they opened it up and I saw all these toys and presents. And I was like, oh, and I wanted to get them. And they're like, nope, nope, nope. You're going to see these again in a couple of days. And then on Christmas morning, when we opened presents and it was all the things I'd already seen, five-year-old Julie connected the dots that Santa Claus didn't exist. And I was like, oh, so, um, but it was not, I mean, like, I'm not, I wasn't traumatized by it. I just realized at a really young age, there was no Santa Claus because my older siblings are assholes. They still are. Well, my sister, not so much, but the rest of them, they are. Well, that's um, memorable for sure. That is memorable for sure. We'll be back tomorrow with more talk on the most wonderful time of year.